Welcome back everyone. Today we're going to be revealing our deepest, darkest secrets on our iPhones. Oh no. <laughs> so we're doing what's on our iPhone, husband versus wife edition, which I already know the direction this is going to go because our phones are so different from each other. Like I feel like. It's true. You'll see. You'll see just by like our watch history, the mm -hmm. amount of photos we take, what, I don't, like how many alarms we have, like, oh, we couldn't be more different. <laughs> so this is going to be very interesting. I feel like I already kind of know what's on your phone. You kind of already know what's on my phone, but they don't know. Okay. So we're going to start off with the first thing, which is our lock screen. Oh, okay. wait, and our phone case, and our oh. phone case. So let's do our phone case first. Ta-da. This is not sponsored, but we both use Case Defy. <laughs> yeah, mine is a astronaut roasting the planets on a stick over a star fire. <laughs> it's cool, <laughs> I like it. I like more monochromatic, so mine's black, as you can tell. Um, but it's like a little forest, because I love nature. <laughs> And yeah. this is, ew. Oh, ew. I've been meaning to clean my phone. Inside Gross. my case is so nasty right now. Mmm, delicious. Ew. To oh, girly pop. <laughs> <laughs> Stop. Stop it right now. How do you live with that? I don't know. It just, oh. you don't see the dust that's underneath the case when the case oh. is on, so. Gross. Okay. That's really nasty. Okay, well, we know what we're I doing after this video. The inside of my case. Oh, the inside of my case it's is disgusting so gross. too. <laughs> okay, let's move on. Let's move on. Yeah, they want to see what's on our phone, not, not what's on the outside of our phones. phones. So here's my lock screen. Show you your lock screen. Here's my lock screen. <laughs> we Aww, have matching. So cute. So, cute. Oh, so no. some Do of I our have? past. Oh, I guess oh. I just have one. Unfortunately for you, I removed the lock screen that... Which one? The pig's booty. <laughs> you remember that? You put a picture of a pig's booty as my lock screen. <laughs> and it came up... I think I deleted it because <laughs> somehow on my phone, it switched that to my default lock screen, and I didn't know how to change it back. <laughs> okay, next. <laughs> so gross. Okay, so we're kind of boring. Our... Like our main um, yeah, phone screen main is screen, the same. I think. I, we don't even have the cool like organization things that people do. Like I literally, it's just this. Yeah. I think I added like Outlook and Google Drive to the apps on my front screen. But other than that, the layout of this is pretty much what was like the, the default, default yeah. on my phone. This is where most of my like folders are. It's at the top of yours. Uh, reminders widget. Oh. oh, so you do have a widget. Yeah. I don't have any widget. <laughs> Next. That's I, I just the app oh. after that. I just have the two screens. Oh, I have one, a lot of screens. Two, one, two. That's it. Okay, now that you get a little look at our phone screens, let's dive in deeper. <laughs> let's dive in deeper. Oh boy. Okay, first one. Screen time. Uh, <laughs> hey. Mine's more than yours. Spencer's averaging at four hours today. I'm averaging at five. My most used is Safari with 48 minutes. Then oh. my notes app like for 30 barely. minutes in notes. Then Instagram, messages, YouTube, uh, a website, and then maps. So this is what mine looks like. That's my lineup. <laughs> What's your nice. lineup? Mine is... YouTube at the top, then Reddit, then a life total counter for Magic the Gathering. A game. And yes. then an app that keeps track of decks I've built for Magic the Gathering. <laughs> and then our Gospel Library app. Okay. Yeah, my top used app currently with YouTube is nine hours and Reddit after that is an hour and a half. And yes, his so. phone is called Beep Beep Boop. Now we're gonna do one of my favorite things. We're gonna look at our day list. <laughs> hey, <laughs> what kind of music do you listen to on Spotify? So if you didn't know, day list is like a customized playlist by the AI, depending on like what kind of music you listen to at this certain time of the day. So it would change probably about like three times a day. There's like one for morning, afternoon, and evening. So let's go on our Spotify and screenshot our day list of the day. <laughs> What? Mine is healing anti-depression Wednesday afternoon. <laughs> Why does it think I'm so sad? Because this 
morning it was something about moody sad girl or something. Well, I kind of got something like that. Mine is not funny in the title. Mine's just rock-ish alternative Wednesday afternoon. So you're angsty but and depressed. the first song in my day list is called Hate Myself. <gasps> by let down <laughs> oh what is wrong with us <laughs> the song after that's called control free <laughs> and the songs after that's called breathe, breathe. <laughs> let's move into our camera roll take a little walk down camera memory rolls. lane ridiculous <laughs> okay we're gonna go to our newest photo besides the screenshot we just took so i took this today and it's a picture of some um, sunflower seeds that are finally growing. And I was like, oh my gosh, they're growing. And so I had to send it to mom because we like send each other pictures of our gardens. And I was just so excited because I wasn't sure if these were going to grow because they were just some random seeds I got. The latest photo in my camera roll is this, <laughs> which is literally just the water meter in our yard because our sprinkler guy needed to know where it was and he couldn't find it when he was here to like give us a quote so, so we, we found sent him it. a picture saying we found it and yeah so crazy okay now we're gonna scroll to our oldest photo in our camera roll <laughs> what if mine's a video <laughs> you must show right. all right let's watch it <laughs> <laughs> it's so random okay well mine mine's not that juicy it's literally some petroglyphs <laughs> from when we first moved to utah i was obsessed with rocks because growing up in florida there was no rocks and so we found petroglyphs in southern utah and i had to take a picture because of course i'm a park ranger that's right <laughs> That's my third oldest picture. Nice. Um, yeah. Okay. Last thing you Googled. My, is, I, okay. Literally, this is just exposing how much of a plant mom I am. Because the last thing I Googled oh. was daylilies. <laughs> the last thing I Googled was actually to help my mom. Because over the summer, I'm actually helping her, like, start up a business, which is exciting. So the last thing I Googled was something from a marketing class that I learned that's literally just called the ABCs of marketing, which I found that there's like more than one thing has used ABCs of marketing, but the one I was going for is audience, benefit, compelling reason why. Marketing. Smart brains. Hooray. <laughs> Such tea. Yeah. Okay, next. Notes app. I am so excited about this because I am an avid notes user okay that's why it's like a lot on my phone how many notes do you have here let me show you mine i have 575 notes i have 22. <laughs> oh what's on your notes my oldest list is a list of parts for a computer it was basically i created it as like a upgrade path if i wanted to change my computer to have a full custom liquid cooling loop because Spencer likes to build computers. He built his. So that's something I he likes to Jake do. Jake and Ty build their current computers. Yeah, he did. Okay, my oldest note is from 2015. And it's literally video ideas from you guys. Like when we first started our channel. From like 2015. Like all the way back. Bro. Yeah, I, I kept That's those crazy. notes. So I would like just like take a picture or I'd write out their name. And then I would write out the challenge they would want. So yeah, I've got some on here. That's so crazy. I still have this. That is crazy. <laughs> Guess if I get stuck for video ideas, I just go back to this. Newest one. My newest note is our grocery list. And this isn't even our updated grocery list. What's weird is all this stuff showed back up. Like on my grocery list thing, I think I like deleted it all and made like the short grocery list. And then when I logged back into it, it had like put all these things back in it. Yeah. So it doesn't it seem to weird. communicate quite right. So this is like our list is from like weeks ago. Yeah. Okay. Mine is... A recent thing I've started doing, and I've been tracking my dreams, and I've got some crazy dreams on there. Like, let me show you. 
I have been tracking every night. Um, so I'll read a couple of them to you, but if you want a full video of my dreams, let me know. <laughs> my dream was Spencer and I were filming a challenge. Let me just preface by saying a lot of my dreams are either us filming videos, are either about gardening, are about Taekwondo, or about school. I'm not even in school anymore, but it still <laughs> plagues my mind. That's funny. So Spencer and I were filming a challenge where he went to the thrift store to buy me outfits, and then I would try them on and get his reaction, and also Jordan's mom's and Jake's reaction. I guess they were all reacting to the outfits. So for the first outfit, Spencer made me look like Hannah Montana by accident. With by accident? <laughs> yeah, because you didn't mean to make me look like Hannah Montana. But I was like, oh, wait, this looks just like Hannah Montana. <laughs> so you got me a long blonde wig. <laughs> A black mesh top with a red tank top underneath, a pink fluffy skirt, a, ch a chunky like 2010 necklace, and like just the whole outfit looked like Hannah Montana. And when all, while I was trying to film your guys' reaction in the car, some lady was trying to sell you sushi from her stand for lunch. <laughs> It's <laughs> so random. Okay, this one's weird. So my dad watches Facebook shorts a lot. <laughs> you know, like we like to watch TikToks. His thing is Facebook shorts. So dad found a Facebook short, this is my dream, of two sisters and a mom who were YouTubers <laughs> and made a contraption where they tied a bunch of helium balloons to their mom and made her float. So he wanted to do it to our mom, so we tried it, and she almost flew away. <laughs> Any dream interpreters out there, make it make sense. I have so many in here though, and they're wackadoodle. So that's the things on our iPhones. We hope you learned more about us today. Um, that was interesting. Anyways, we hope you guys um, enjoyed this little deep dive into our um, online world. If you liked it, thumbs up as always, and we'll see you in the next video. Bye. Bye.